the round in the kingdom of the divine will, praying with the servant of God, Louisa Picaretta, in the Easter Pentecost round. The round of the kingdom in the divine will in Easter and Pentecost. Praying with the servant of God, Louisa Picaretta, the little daughter of the divine will. May the kingdom of the divine will come to reign on earth. This book does not replace the divine office. It is for private use only. Dedicated March 25th, 2015, The Annunciation of the Lord. Fiat. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My Lord Jesus Christ, come, fuse me in your thrice holy divine will, now, Lord. Come pray in my praying. May these prayers be prayed on behalf of all people of all time, past, present, and future, from fallen Adam to the last creature created. Lord, may these prayers be placed on the lips of every soul, in their minds and their hearts, for the sole purpose of loving you, Lord, giving you that love with which you love yourself already within the thrice holy trinity. Fiat. Friday Daytime Prayer. Him. In every movement of my body, love alone I shall embrace. Of love alone I want to speak, at love alone I want to look. To love alone I want to listen, always of love I want to think. Antiphon the divine will is inexorable, immutable. Round of Creation, 7. Prayer. I feel nothing flow within me but the great sea of the divine will. Everything else does not exist for me. I honor you and I adore you. In the acts that the divine will did in the first father Adam. I honor you and I adore you. In the acts the divine will did in all the saints of the Old Testament. I honor you and I adore you. In the acts the divine will did that made its power stand out. I honor you and I adore you. In the acts the divine will did that made its strength stand out. I love you. Your kingdom come, oh please let it be known, loved, and possessed by the human generations. I honor you and I adore you. In the acts the divine will did that made its vivifying virtue stand out. I honor you and I adore you. In the honor you gave to Adam before the fall. I honor you and I adore you. In the first acts of Adam. I honor you and I adore you. When Adam possessed the unity with the supreme will, I love you. Your kingdom come, oh please let it be known, loved and possessed by the human generations. I honor you and I adore you. When you asked of Noah the sacrifice of building the ark, I honor you and I adore you. In the heroism of Abraham, I honor you and I adore you. In the act of heroism of Abraham, I honor you and I adore you in the act of power of Moses. I love you and pray you that your eternal fiat be known and just as it rains triumphantly in heaven, it may come to reign triumphantly in the midst of creatures. Prayer. I am doing nothing. It is the divine will that carries me in its arms. Therefore, all the glory is of his adorable will. 
Antiphon. The one feels all the weight of the divine will's immutability and therefore remains immutable with its divine immutability. The one is impassive to everything and the divine will places the one in the conditions of wanting whatever the divine will wants. Round of Creation 8. Prayer I want the kingdom of your divine will. I honor you and I adore you. In the act of strength of Samson, I honor you and I adore you. In the act of revealing what regarded the future Redeemer to the prophets, I honor you and I adore you. When you manifested the divine volition to the prophets, I honor you and I adore you. When you manifested the how of the coming of the future Redeemer to your people, I love you. Your kingdom come, oh please let it be known, loved and possessed by the human generations. I honor you and I adore you. When you manifested the when of the coming of the future Redeemer to them, I honor you and I adore you. In the prophets, longing for the Redeemer, I honor you and I adore you. In their tears, I honor you and I adore you. In their prayers, I honor you and I adore you. In their penances, I love you. Your kingdom come, oh please let it be known, loved and possessed by the human generations. I honor you and I adore you. In all the prodigies the divine will did in the saints, I honor you and I adore you. In all the prodigies the divine will did in the patriarchs, I honor you and I adore you. In all the prodigies the divine will did in the prophets of the Old Testament, I honor you and I adore you. In all the prodigies the divine will did after Jesus' is coming upon earth, I honor you and I adore you. In asking for the divine kingdom in the midst of creatures, I love you and pray you that your eternal fiat be known, and just as it reigns triumphantly in heaven, it may come to reign triumphantly in the midst of creatures. Prayer I want the kingdom of your fiat. Antiphon Everything the divine will wants must be done, but nothing must be done of what the soul wants, not even a comma. Round of Creation 9 Prayer Jesus, you who love and want that your will be done, help me, assist me, and feed me this divine will of yours in every instant, so that nothing else may have life in me. I honor you and I adore you. To my Creator in all your acts, I honor you and I adore you. In the residence of earth, I honor you and I adore you. In all the residence of the earth, I honor you and I adore you. In all its inhabitants, I honor you and I adore you. In all their heartbeats, I honor you and I adore you. Through each heartbeat, I love you. Your kingdom come, oh please let it be known, loved and possessed by the human generations. I honor you and I adore you. In every heartbeat, I honor you and I adore you. Through every heart. I honor you and I adore you through every heart of creatures. I honor you and I adore you, wanting to enclose myself in every heart. I honor you and I adore you and shout from within every heart, I love you. I honor you and I adore you in the love of all creatures. I honor you and I adore you to my creator in every affection. I honor you and I adore you, and every drop of blood. I honor you and I adore you, to my Creator in every breath. I honor you and I adore you, 
in the air that creatures breathe. I love you and pray you that your eternal fiat be known, and just as it rains triumphantly in heaven, it may come to rain triumphantly in the midst of creatures. Prayer My sweet good, it is true that I am very dissimilar from you. But if you want, you can render me similar. Antiphon What renders the soul more dear, more beautiful, more lovable, more intimate with the divine being? Is her perseverance in this way of behaving, of pleasing me alone, which renders her immutable with the immutability of God? You have reached the end of Friday Daytime Prayer. Fiat. Yeah.